Mm -hmm. um, you can think of artists as being um, small business owners because they are doing everything from A to Z themselves, whether it's marketing themselves, um, setting up their own websites. Obviously in Minnesota, arts are very important to us and with the legacy funding, it's just become how apparent we value our local arts and that there really is an opportunity to create a career out of it. Springboard for the Arts is a nonprofit. We're headquartered in St. Paul, although we serve the five state upper Midwest region. And we exist for the sole purpose of helping creative types like you all with the business nuts and bolts of making a life in the arts. So we work with visual artists, we work with performing artists, we work with literary artists. Each of the workshops that we have offered, there has been so many people trying to get in that we've had to ha open up a wait list. The biggest uh, user group that's been attending have been adults 45 years and older. So it might be um, people who are choosing a second career in life and aren't familiar with the business side of being an artist. This evening, we're going to talk about copyrights. What are they? What you should know about them? And it's like this whole mysterious area for people not just for artists, but for all kinds of people. The second biggest user group we've had for this program has been 25 to 34 year olds. So mm -hmm. I think it's interesting to get those two different age groups together. Um, it's sort of become an intergenerational program where there are artists from two different generations who can share their ideas and learn from one another.